something over the internet with the credit card. Put your hands up. Now, if you haven't got your hand up already, put your hand up now. Wow, 100%, that's pretty good. Okay, now, I bought something over the internet and I, thought I was done. Now, it's, <coughs> I wrote away and said, a do-it-yourself funeral kit. $100 will do for the whole family. I thought, now, that, that is a good bargain. So I sent away for it, and this is what came. Brown paper package, do it yourself funeral kit. And I've been done. <laughs> uh, I could have got it cheaper at Bunnings. There, uh, so be careful whatever you buy over the internet. Be careful. Okay, right. Speaking of buying things, anyone here got 50 bucks? I need to, this is called the money game. We need to borrow $50. Anyone got, oh, that's right, you're entertainers. Uh, but look, any, truly, has anyone got $50? We can go to 20 if we have to. $2 coin. $2 coin, you stay where you are. You got a 50, oh, hold on to that for the moment. Oh, thank goodness for that. Now, we also need a helper to, to help you with that. Um, We'll get this gentleman to come up and help us. What's your name, sir? Ken. Ken, give Ken a round of applause. Come over here, Ken. You don't have to hold on to those. Ken has got five envelopes, and each one contains a piece of paper, a piece of newsprint, cut to the size of a $50 note. Now, if you were to put these down here and mix them all up, any card chops out there know if you just flip one of them up, they'll see what the numbers are. And it's very important nobody knows what these numbers are. So what we're going to do, Ken, hang on there. We'll put this around. So you have to spread your five over there, mix them up. And we'll come over here. The lady's got $50. Can I get you to initial it? So if we see it again later, you'll be able to recognize it. Just put, no, it's already ready to write. But the other end. Yeah, the other end. It's one of those tricky ones, okay? Just put your initials there. Have you got them mixed up? Okay, now Ken, push one to one side. One of those envelopes, just push it to one side for a moment. I want you to open that envelope, don't get it mixed with the others. Open the envelope and take out the piece of newsprint. Okay? Now, keep that one to one side. Can I have the piece of newsprint? And don't look at the number. Now, this is going to be your receipt. See, same size as your 50. Let me just sign this. Okay, if anything goes wrong, at least you've got something for your money. There you go. I'll do that. Now we'll take the 50. Now, Ken, slide that into the envelope that the piece of paper came out of. And then they're all peel and stick, so peel it off, stick it down. Keep it face down. Don't, don't look at the numbers. Now, can you do the same to all the others? Just leave the pieces of paper in there. Peel and stick everyone. Peel and stick, peel and stick. You want somebody to throw the paper? You can do it. Throw it into there. Great. He's just about done it. Ta da! They're all one more to do. Great. Two more to do. Okay. I'll let you do the counting. That's fine. Ken's just about lost your 50 in there somewhere. Okay, get it? Now mix them all up. Yep. Okay, we'll take this away. We don't need this bit anymore. Whew. Glad it didn't break. Okay. <laughs> Ken, um, turn them all face up now. Now, ladies and gentlemen, the uh, universal symbol for gambling is dice. This is what the glass is for. So what you're going to do, Ken, is shake it up, tip it out, and you've got two dice, choose any one you like. You've got a five or a six. We don't have a six. Do we have a five in there? Yeah. Find five? Yeah. Okay. We're going to eliminate this one. And we've got a special eliminator over here. And know, where's the power going to? It was working before. Has it been unplugged? <laughs> Oh, 
little bit silly, they think. Then it was all set to go. Something. Plug it in there, keep it in. Oh. <laughs> Did you notice where the money went? We just lost one. Hey, I just checked if there's any pink pieces in there. Looks all right for the moment. <laughs> What's your name again? My name. Yes. You should know it. You're the magician. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> we have help. Check again. Check again. We've got some more to get rid of. <laughs> See what your number comes up. We've got a one or a five. Oh, we've got rid of five. Number. Hey, you have a two. Shove it in there. Shove it in there. Sorry. Yeah, just put it in there. This is the, oh, there it goes. How are you feeling? Pretty good, okay. Okay, again, quick checking, but another three, well, three, but I'm only going to get rid of two more. Six and five, got rid of it, done. Okay, those, what we got? No, I've done those, one to six. <laughs> two, five, nine. Good for another game, but not for this. But we got three. You, you're going to have a, look, he's reaching for it. Okay, go, you have a go. Down the shredder it goes. Uh, two more to go. This is really nerve wracking. We want a four or a two. Four or a two? Four or a two or a, oh no, keep going. This will just subtract one from the five there. No, we still won't move. No, keep going, keep going. Once you get down to only two numbers, it's, oh, we've got four. Hey, can I have a go? You, it's my two, okay. Just, Da -da. Great. Ken, you've done a great job. You've eliminated the ball down. We've got number two left. Let's give Ken a round of applause for his trouble. Thank you, Ken. Now, you have a choice. I trust you. The contents of the envelope or the contents of the shredder. It's your choice. What would you like? I'll go, I'll go for the shredder one, please. Oh. And I can keep this? <laughs> I think you've got it hidden underneath something. No, 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 I'll go for it. You better have this. <laughs> you better have that one. Open it up, open it up. and put us out of our misery. Piece of newsprint? Yes. It's got your initials? Yes, it is. Thanks for playing the money game. Very good. Now we need three active ladies for this next item. Let's sell Sue, you can do this, let's see. Uh, are you active? What is it? Oh, uh, you, you can, you're closer, you can come and help. Go oh, Sue, jump up the front here. Quick, up the front. You're not doing anything, are you? And neither is he if I take you, so come on over here. We've got, we've got three, or uh, two. Where's that third? Come on, you, you, you're the one. She wanted a round of applause. That's what it was. Now look, it doesn't really matter. There's no right or wrong side of this. Look, there are three lanyards there. There's three different colours. Just take one, hang it around your neck. One inch. Don't fight over them. <laughs> Got one there? Uh, leave the piece of the piece of paper goes with it. Did you just take your piece off? Yes, I did. <laughs> okay, you're right, you shove it around your neck, that's great. You're all fine, okay, great. Do you play cards? Mm -hmm. I, go, I don't know what that means, but uh, look, digging cards. Just, just touch the back of any card. Hook that one there, okay. Hold your hand out flat. Now don't look at the card yet till I turn away. Okay, have a look at it. Remember that card. Where is it? I don't want to see. Put these back. Remember the card. In a few moments, I'm going to try and make you forget that card. But you won't forget, will you? Don't, don't forget the card, OK? Uh, this is one of these old-fashioned little watches. You pull this bit out here and twiddle this around. Changes the time. Well, I don't want to see what time I'm going to end up, so will you twiddle it? Perhaps some time, just the end of that way. Ta -da. Happy with that? Let's stick it in. Now, I'm going to open it up. You're going to have a quick look at the time you stopped at. Don't say anything out loud. Got a time, you remember that? Wasn't the time the day you were born, was it? You've forgotten, that's right. Now, Sue, you haven't done anything yet. What can we do with you? Oh, I tell you what. When we rushed out, we must have dropped something because the book that was here is probably on the floor over there. So I'll just go and get it. 
Wonderful, thank you very much. This is called Unusually Stupid Celebrities. So I'm sure your name's not in there, but uh, there's, there's hundreds of them. There's hundreds of them. Okay. Now I'm just going to flick through till you say stop. You're going to stop on it random, okay? Stop. Stop. Now don't say anything out loud. Do you stop me on a page that's got a name on it? Yes. Is it someone you know? Not personally. Not, not personally, that's right. You, you won't forget. Okay, right. Let's get rid of that. Now, in a few moments, I'm going to hope you won't forget those various things. But we're now going to give you something to do. Hold on to that. Don't open the top. You have one. And one over here. That's great. Now, just don't open the top. But look around the bag. Use your x-ray vision. And see if you can tell what colour item is in the bag. Don't spend too much time, you can't. Open the top and have a look at the side. <coughs> open, open, open the top. Now just take a wee handle, don't pull the whole thing out. And just pull it out, see what colour you've got. What have you got? Quick, quick, we have it. Blue, blue, silver, green. Oh, I think, okay, tuck it in, tuck it in. Okay, now come on a wee bit closer. We're just going to play musical bags, okay? Will you just mix, mix the bags up? Mix the bags up, just mix them up. Mix them up, here we go. Mixing the bags. Mix them up, mix them up, keep them going, keep them going. Okay, keep mixing, and stop there, that's enough. Okay, great. Now, I'm going to give, throw one of these on the ground, you can each grab one. You see, it's a, I'll give you all the hard stuff to this, so, no, I said three active ladies, and we've got one here. Okay, right, okay, open the top, put the black bag inside. It'll fit, I know, I had it in there before. Okay, keep the top over on the inside and draw a string. Draw a string. Okay, you've got yours in there. I think the black bit tipped up. You don't want anything showing. Got yours done. Okay, and mix them again. Mix up the bags. Mix up the bags. Pass them around, pass them around. Pass them around. And stop. Drop them on the floor. Drop them on the floor. Have well, I worn you out yet? I hope you haven't forgotten those things you're remembering. Yes. <laughs> uh, did you catch? Ta da! Any glasses? <laughs> Someone on the side. And somebody in the middle. Oops, what? Okay. Who had the red one? Okay, you. Oops, sorry. Sticky fingers. Grab hold of the red one. You had blue. And you had silver. Okay. Now, first thing I want you to do is grab my wrist. Just one of you at a time, okay? This is what we call a psychic connection. <laughs> Follow me. Follow me. Where's the bag? Where's the bag? Just, I don't want to touch it. Just follow me. Where are we? It's like dancing here. Don't leave, don't leave. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I'll get you to stand there, that's fine. Right. Grab my wrist. Right, okay. There's people who... No, I did feel better over here. You stand there. Thanks very much. Quick last one. Grab my wrist. Can you stand there? Come on there. Right. Right. Okay. Right. And the lady in the middle there, open the red bag. This one, this one, yeah. Open the red bag. Open the black bag. And if we have a match, give her a round of applause, see what we've come up with. Take it out. We have a match! Well done! Now, can you bring everything up to the front? I want you to take the two tasty bits. Yeah, you hold on to both of those. Everything else goes in the bag. Okay, stand in the middle there. Okay, ladies on the outside. Open the red bags. Okay, you can swing the spot over here because we've got enough light at this side. That's wonderful. What have you got? Bring everything to the front. We've got a match. 
We head to the back. Quickly, come up to the front. Oh, I'll grab the bag. You got everything there? Bag in the bag. This is the bag here, throw it in there. Okay. No, no, you hold those. Some people, like, they can stand up here in the front. Ladies and gentlemen, at great expense tonight we have, you got two, the VAC cheerleaders with their favourite moves. Oh, now that I wear you out. Yes. Okay. You had, you're thinking of a celebrity? Yes. Take off the lanyard from around your neck. <laughs> Just one thing, ain't you? Don't undress, that's right. There's a bit of paper. What was your celebrity? I've got to tell you now. Yeah. Who was it? Charlie Sheen. Oh, Charlie Sheen. Okay. Open the piece of paper, see what you got. Charlie Sheen, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you, guys. Give a round of applause. Nancy, you guys, like, thank you. Take your one off. And you chose a playing card, didn't you? What's a playing card? You didn't forget the card? What was the name of your playing card? Seven clubs. Seven clubs. Oh. Okay, open up, see what we've got. Oh, is that close? The Seven of Clubs, ladies and gentlemen. Well, you may take a seat. Thank you very, very much. You can get that. Now, what did you do? Oh, you, you chose a time of day, and you didn't know what day you were born. I mean, what, you, what time of the hour you were what, what was the time you looked at? 4.15. Did we get it anywhere near? Oh, 4.15. Well done. Thank you very much. Oh. You've all been out. You've been a wonderful audience. Thank you very much, and good luck. It's a wonderful way to <laughs> We're going to take a short five minute break now, ladies and gentlemen, to refresh your